Whether it's through citation or education, some communities around Southern California are struggling with how to put some enforcement heft behind their efforts to get citizens to abide by orders requiring them to wear masks in public during the coronavirus pandemic. When non-uniformed staff or volunteers are tasked, some have have faced pushback, even threats. But officials have grappled with whether it's appropriate to devote law enforcement's time, resource and personnel to the effort. The bottom line, despite definitive scientific evidence that shows masks can stem the spread of the virus, plus state, city and county orders making it a misdemeanor to be maskless in public and endless, sometimes emotional, pleas from public health officials who are begging residents to comply, some people still aren't getting the message. It's not a majority, most officials said, but enough to cause alarm, particularly with the pandemic pushing into its most severe and deadliest wave yet. In Pasadena, officials tried enlisting the help of volunteers to hand out masks and educate the public. The hate mail started to flow as soon as the program was announced. Pasadena spokeswoman Lisa Dedarian said staffers have received direct threats via email and indirect threats on social media. That includes several people who suggested the volunteers would be attacked if they tried to enforce the mandate, though that didn't come to pass over the program's brief tenure. At this point, we're re-evaluating how we'll be out enforcing it and which personnel we'll use in the field, whether it's at our parks, the Rose Bowl Loop, Old Pasadena or anywhere else people are gathering," she said. When the state order came down, Pasadena, which has required residents to wear masks outside their homes for months, put up signage around key recreational areas, including 60 flyers around the Rose Bowl. All 60 signs were ripped down and torn up, like somebody aggressively wanted to make a point, Dedarian said. Just absolutely shredded them. And, you know, public works crews have better things to do than pick up trash from somebody's political agenda. Like many other cities, Pasadena isn't planning to cite people yet, preferring education campaigns over the alternatives, but some cities opted for a different approach. In Lancaster, failing to wear a mask has been an infraction since March, Mayor Rex Paris 